Hello everybody, so today I want to try and build a plane with an ejection seat of sorts, except it kind of takes the whole cockpit and just kind of detaches it from the rest of the plane, allowing it to float safely to the ground, or as safely as you can when, when you have nothing but a cockpit. So I want to see if I can uh, make a plane that can do that. I'm thinking I'll, I'll make something that kind of the like wind boom, I think it's called style aircraft, something like the P-38 where you have almost pod of the um, cockpit and then two separate fuselages. Uh, so that's what I'm probably going to do. Okay, so somehow, just by building this, um, I got the forces lined up pretty much perfectly. That's looking, well, kind of ugly, but that's okay. Let's see how this flies. It is, it's not the prettiest, uh, aircraft. Uh, those elevators, I think, they're probably pulling up way too much. It even has some yaw, um, might want to increase that if I want to do anything. Uh, roll is, can be increased. Oh wow, that's, pitch, pitch is actually alright. And that should be able to just, oh. Um. Uh, that, that could be an issue. Uh, so that's getting caught, um, pretty bad. Uh, what if I use some of these? Oh, there we go. Maybe that'll let it. I'll just slip out. All right, the roll is maybe even a bit too much now. Oh boy, this is, yeah, I think a bit too much roll. All right, and detach. Oh, oh, what? It's a missile or a bomb. That's actually kind of cool. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> I didn't actually use this, but I should probably configure that. Actually, if I put that on left shift and then just add, let's say, uh, I don't know, one second delay. All right, let's see. And shift. <laughs> oh, I think that's a little too much power. We're going up. <gasps> oh no, there goes the plane. I wonder if I could actually make this like a separate plane. Okay, wait, now I kind of want to do that. I think that would be uh, a more fun idea. So instead of doing what I was going to do with the gimbal jet, I could instead see if I can just add on little, well, I don't know how much lift these will produce, but let's just say, for example, I did those and here I can actually, I can sneak in two of these guys there. Maybe these actually. I actually, oh wait, I wonder if I just have this, oh, I'm gonna just guess where that it's gonna need to be. Uh, that's gonna be way too much, but we'll see. I'm curious to see how this works. We take off. Oh my. That's, that is a lot of pitch now. Alright, and detach. Oh, whoa. It actually flies, oh no. It flies somewhat straight, and then we just lose all speed. Okay, maybe I should put on some of these, and, and I, now I don't have room for any ailerons. Actually, oh wait, I, I could probably use seat controls. That would probably work. The pitch is good now, and roll. Is yaw? Oh, yaw kind of does something now. All right, and detach. Oh wow, that's pretty straight. Whoa, I could probably, oh. Seat controls are not really doing anything. And now I guess I'm gonna need ailerons somehow. Actually, I wonder if I move those back and then just take those. I, hmm, that's gonna be really weird. But I think it'd be really cool if I actually got this to work. Now the whole plane kind of pitches up now. That's not great. All right, let's level off and detach. Oh, that flies really straight out. Oh, okay, kind of pitches, whoa. That is a lot of roll control. Pitch is still excessive. Oh, I wonder if I could actually add power to this. This is getting out of hand now. I'll use this one, throw in a little curve there. And I'm going to eventually probably want to make it so these all these controls don't activate until I've detached. Okay, we're up. It seems to be flying pretty well. And detach. Oh my. Oh. Okay, I think I need to up the speed on the, um roll and give it less 
pitch. I, I don't know. This is it handles really weird. Whoa, but it is working. Whoa. Oh no, don't hit the. Okay, I didn't need that uh, aileron. That was actually purely a. Oh no. Okay, maybe I did need that. Oh, and now I'm below the map. Let's just detach. I think the winds might need to go forward a bit. Oh, the pitch is actually kind of good now. I can actually I can increase it, but it does fly. <laughs> this is surprising. All right, I guess now's as good a time as any to go ahead and add in the logic. I will make that space it goes into the AND gate. So those both go into here. And then when both conditions are met, we trigger the propeller. Perfect. Okay, now that doesn't spin. I actually might move that propeller to the back to make it a little more inconspicuous. We detach. And now the propeller does not work. Okay, so wait, why does that not work? But main space, it doesn't do anything. I toggle on that. This does not make any sense. What am I doing wrong here? Okay, wait, what if I put one of, th or put one of them in there? Does that, what? Why does that make it work? Okay, I have no idea why that works. I, well, it now functions, the repeller. I think I'm definitely gonna move that to the back. But now if I detach, that spins up. And then I can go fly away in this. That works surprisingly well. Okay, now you really cannot see that propeller. I mean, it still kind of looks like there's a, no, no, no. Oh. Um, oh, you know, <laughs> you know. You know, it may help if I actually have it so the propeller facing backwards is also spinning backwards. Um, you know, so that way I don't get instantly sucked into my tail fin. Okay. Oh. Oh, that... Um... Okay, a rear propeller may not work. Well, actually, maybe it's a center of thrust thing. Okay, wait. I might know how to fix this. Uh, I feel like a weight block is gonna... It's not going to connect, that's what it's going to do. <laughs> Alright, let's see how this goes. And go. Oh. Oh, it actually flies really straight. Oh no, it, I can feel it wanting to spin out so much. It needs more um, horizontal drag. But let's use some paddles. Those always work. Actually, yeah, I guess the cockpit is technically covering everything behind it. But I'm not... 100% no, uh, alright, that's fine. I'm not 100% sure how that affects things. Oh, uh, it was not fine. Disconnect. We are flying extremely straight. It still wants to drift, uh, or drift, well, drift in the air. I could technically add some yaw to this, but I think that's a little overkill. Let's see if I can fly through this tunnel. Oh boy, I think the pitch is a little too intense. So let's go ahead and I guess paint it up and then let's see if I can do some fun stuff with it. Oh. My uh, well the little plane survived. Alright, let's go paint this. I'm not entirely sure what kind of theme I went for here. I made most of the plane kind of grayish, and then the little one, um, black and green. It looks fine, I guess. I also added in some- oh, not right in the sun. Uh, see if I can get this out of the shadows. Some exhaust things coming from the, uh, engine, whatever, I don't know what those are called. Alright, let's see how hard it is to fly- oh no. Oh, uh, that, that did not go well. I was gonna say, let's see how- oh, and I'm spinning. Let's see how hard it is to fly through there, just using the little plane, because that is not nearly as easy to fly as this. Oh! Alright, let's go. Oh, I, uh, I was worried I was gonna get hit by that. Oh no. Alright, went around. Detach. I'll just leave that plane behind. Whoa! All right, that was not too bad. Okay, I have come up with a very good use for this. <laughs> so I have added in a total of four pieces of dynamite in here, and I want to see if I can actually detect. Oh, they're shooting at me! 
uh, detach this and then have it <laughs> and then have it fly into a balloon. Uh, not like that. Um, I want to actually have it explode and get away from it. So let's go, I don't know, over here, I guess. This thing might need some landing gear, but I don't really feel like adding that. Let's see if I can dive bomb one of these. So I think this thing kind of drops down. So let's do, it did not really drop down. Okay. Um, oh, it does blow up on him. Oh, whoa. Oh, wait, I, I should probably go for the red one. I'm not sure if this blows up on the balloon. Will it be enough to kill it? All right, let's go. That is going to be a miss. All right, so go. Oh, oh, no. Oh, uh, it, it did not. It and I died. <laughs> that was um, that was pretty pathetic. Oh wait, I have an idea. What if I add in, I don't know, somewhere, let's say over here, this is gonna become asymmetrical now, but that's fine. Let's throw in one of these. Uh, let's set it to left shift, have it on both of those, but then give it a delay of two. And now, the engine should re-engage. We'll do a little test here. The engine should re-engage afterwards, I hope, if I don't hit that. I Okay, that. Oh no, I might even able to take off from this point. Okay, I am. Right, so if I detach, oh yes, they do. They re-engage. Oh. Oh no. Oh oh. Wh okay, that was that was just rude. All right, detach. No. What? Okay. We, we, oh wait, I can still fly, oh well. Alright, so we can obviously not pitch up immediately. Alright, let's see if I can do this. Detach. Go. Alright. Go, go. Oh, come on. No, it was so close. Wait, air repair? No, no, no. If that hits the dynamite, that's not good. Oh! Oh, it... Okay, it got it, but I don't, I don't think that counts. <laughs> um, there's- okay, good, there's another red balloon here. That definitely does not count, because I died. Detach. Pitch down. Not die. Oh, oh no, it, it went to the side, what? Alright, let's just go. Oh, that was horrible. Alright, I have to be a bit closer, I think. Alright. Alright, there's no way that misses. Dive. No! <laughs> it got it! Oh good, there's a balloon right there. I, okay, I need to be closer. If I'm too close, I just die. So let's let's do a little better here. All right, this is very lined up. Detach. Oh, not the tree. Oh, what? What? How? The, no, it was, it was right there. What? Okay, there's no way this misses. Detach. Oh no, I went to the side. This, I, I'm feeling it for this one. It's gonna work. Detach. No! That. Okay, well that, that's just cheating. They fired back. They're not supposed to do that. Okay, okay, there's no way. Oh! <gasps> no, no! <gasps> yes! <gasps> Wait, no, I... <gasps> oh my... <gasps> okay, you know what? If they weren't shooting back, I, I would have made it. So, you know, I, I think I call that a success on the, um, whatever this is, the, um, aircraft with a, another aircraft. Now, you might as well just use a bomb, or better yet, a missile, those are easier to aim. Uh, or even guns. But, you know what? <laughs> this is, um... This is really something. I'd say that was a success. I originally set out just to make something that, well, I thought just dropped. And then, you know, used a gimbal jet, but that was too easy. So we made a plane, and then used the, I guess, the mother plane, the mothership thing, to actually bomb things. <laughs> that was pretty fun. All right, well, that was a lot uh, different than the last thing I did. At least this is a more normal-looking plane, sort of. This was still a really weird idea, but I think that's what this is going to be, just lots of weird ideas. Well, anyway, I think that's about it for this. Um... This actually turned out really well. Um, let's see what I come up with for the next one.